Hi, my name is Anya, and I am part of a Five Minds Minera Challenge. And today is Thursday, July 31st, and I am going to do my first recording. There have been some really awesome key events that have shaped my life, and I believe this challenge will be yet another key. I want to share some of those keys um, that have occurred, some good, some bad, and I'm just going to kind of go right through them because um, I'm 37 years old and there has been quite a few that looking back through all of my journaling um, in my life really have been significant. So one is I grew up on a farm and we raised horses. We had dogs and cats, and we we're a huge part of 4-H, and I just feel like I have learned a lot of my responsibility and um, some life lessons from there. Um, I also, at 13 years old, was adopted by my dad, who is still my dad today. Um, when I was eight months old, my birth dad was killed in a car accident, and it was just my mom and I, and then... Um, my little brother came along and it just was a really awesome experience that I was um, officially part of my dad's family and since then um, I total now have three brothers and a sister. Um, another key event was in high school my junior year I lost a really good friend to suicide that taught me um, at a young age what life and death is truly about and um, people's way of thinking or not thinking <laughs> rather um, just some really hard lessons to learn in high school also another big lesson of mine was going off to college I live in Illinois and have been born and raised in Illinois all my life and I decided to go to nursing school in Minnesota and no one went with me of my friends that I knew. So I went up there with no friends and no family and had to learn to live on my own at 18 years old. Um, it ended up being an incredible experience and further keys in my life have um, come from that. Also my nursing school graduation, I uh, graduated and uh, worked as an ER nurse for 10 years and that was another key part of my life. Um, especially because my 10 years I worked as an ER nurse were on midnight shift and that pretty much can um, be a life lesson in itself. Um, my marriage to my husband Dave in 1993 was absolutely an incredible key um, factor in my life and we will be celebrating this year 15 years. The births of my children Samantha in 1996, Dylan in 1998, and Colton in 2002 have absolutely been key events in, in our life. Moving back home from Minnesota where I went to college and lived for seven years, started my marriage there and um, my life as a nurse and then moved back to my home here in Illinois and started to raise my family. That was a huge step in my life and it really looking back now shaped who I am today for many reasons um, my parents were back here still and they helped raise our kids um, in a fun way whenever we needed to go out or um, we worked a lot of opposite shifts and we had a little layover my husband's a police officer so we um, had my mom and dad helping with some of those layover hours here and there and um, they moved away when our kids were young and it was just a really significant time in my life so they wanted to mention that was one of my keys um, also my baptism as a Christian was as an adult I grew up on my life with religion in my life but never knew who um, Christ really was until my baptism as an adult and that was when I was pregnant with my third child in 2002 so it really was life-changing 
my son Dylan, my nine-year-old now, um, was diagnosed recently with a neurological disorder and came out of nowhere for us, so another um, significant time in our life. And any camp experience that I ever had as a child and now, even as an adult, through 4-H, through um, church, all of those experiences have been phenomenal. And each time I go to one of those camps um, and help shape the lives of other kids, I realize that they truly are shaping my life. And now, this time in my life, I am switching gears and I am going from my hospital base nursing into my own business and I am realizing after today's lesson with um, the principles of life-changing events and just things that we talked about today that I have a lot of growth to do but I'm very excited about it so um, I'm looking forward to this challenge.